What's going on guys? It's your boy Jesse D123 back with another video and in today's video we're going to be bringing you guys all the hidden rewards for all the Team Affinity Season 2 Conquest maps. Yes guys, that means three maps in this one video. Drop a like if you guys are excited man. If you guys have not clicked that subscribe button yet, please consider doing so. We're on the road to 1500 subs man, so please be the cool guy or girl that helps us get there. I really appreciate it, but before we get into the video, I want to give a shout out. Shout out to my boy A&R Gaming, your comments on screen bro. Appreciate you for being the first person to comment in last video. Now, if you guys are not the first person to comment on this video, please be the first person to comment on future videos. Because if you guys want to be like my boy AR Gaming, you will get a shout out in one of the next videos that I upload if you guys are the first person to comment. So please, I encourage you guys to rush to the videos, drop a comment, and drop a like as well. But without further ado, man, let's get right into this. As you guys know, there's three conquest maps, the East Affinity 2, the Central Affinity 2, and the West Affinity 2. Now, each map grants you about eight hidden rewards. They give you two ball impacts that are hidden rewards. And there's a goal that gets you another ball in pack. And then there's also another goal that gets you a five pack bundle in each of these. So you guys get 15 standard packs for completing the whole map, not to mention the hidden standard packs. And then you get a total of three ball in packs, two hidden ball in packs, and then one from the goal. So honestly, these maps are really, really good, guys. You guys need to hop on them. But before I throw up the image on screen, I want to give a shout out. Shout out to my boy, Light Skin Chris, man. We collaborated again and we got these maps done for you guys. Um, his video, he probably dropped it already, but I'll link it down in the description. Go show him some love, man. He's a real one. He's a GOAT. Appreciate you, bro. We got this done for the community. And yeah, so I had to throw that in there because me and him, we collaborated, got it done. But let's go through it, man. So the first one we're going to throw on screen, I'm going to check on my computer. The first one we're throwing up on screen is the East Affinity one. So you guys are looking at it right now. Let's go over it. So we got a ball and pack. Then we get a show pack, then a set nine headliner, a thousand stubs, another ball and pack, a show pack, another show pack, and to top it off, another show pack. So this map, honestly, is pretty nice. Um, in each one of these packs, we do get a headliner, which is cool. Like I said, mentioned earlier, we get two ball and packs, and we get one, two, three, four show packs from here, and also with a thousand stubs. So this one's honestly a really good map. Now let's jump into the next one, which is going to be the central one. So we got the central affinity two map on screen right now for you guys. We get, we get a show pack from here, another ball and pack, that's set six headliner. Under that, we get a show pack. To the right, we get a 1K stubs. To the right of that, we get a show pack. Above that, we get another ball and pack. And to top it off, we get a show pack. So like I said, guys, we're getting two ball and packs as hidden rewards. And then we're going to be getting a third ball and pack through the goals. So these maps are really, really nice, man. Honestly, probably one of the best ones yet, to be honest. And what sucks is that we only can complete it once and get the team affinity points once. I wish we could redo these because these honestly aren't too bad. And the final map that I'm going to throw up on screen is going to be the West one. So you guys see it on your screen right now. Let's go through it. So we got the thousand stubs. We got a ball and pack. Under that, we got a show pack. To the right of that, we got another show pack. Above that, we got a show pack. To the right of that, we got another show pack. And then on the top part, we got a set seven headliner and then another ball and pack. So as you guys can see, man, these maps are worth doing. They give you a good amount of rewards, a lot of hidden packs. Honestly, it's about time, SDS. You've freaking been... The UFO Conquest map, I thought there was going to be way more juicier rewards, but there's so much more better rewards in these freaking Team Affinity maps than that UFO one. Let's be real. Just to recap, guys, I'm going to be throwing up the images one more time for you. So we have the East map that we're looking at, and we get a good amount of packs from here. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs, hidden packs from here. Then we're going to move on to the Central, and then we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, another seven hidden pack from here. And then to top it all off, we're going to move on to the west. And I believe we get seven from here as well, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So we get seven hidden rewards or seven hidden packs from each conquest map. It's honestly, you guys got to go get this done. So many packs. And hopefully you guys be pulling Mike Trout or Jacob DeGrom or Garrett Cole or Acuna. Just make some studs with these packs, man. I pray and hope you guys do. Comment down below. Who did you guys pull from these packs? Let me know. I want to know if you guys pulled Trout, DeGrom, Garrett Cole, Acuna. Let me know down in the comments because... I'll let you guys know what I pull. But yeah, man, so that's where I'm going to end today's video, man. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. It's been your boy, Jesse D123, and I'm out.